Let us go to Dave, Levittown, Pennsylvania, the great WNTP. Go. Hey, Mark, what a pleasure to talk to you. First time caller. I've listened to you for a little over a year. I just talked to your producer. I do missions trips to Guatemala two times a year. We just got back this month. I told him, we, you know, we, we talked to the kids and the people in the community. Nobody's clamoring to get out of Guatemala. I agree with you. I think this is orchestrated by this administration. Uh, I have two sponsored children, and my little girl told me for the first time that she wants to be a teacher, and at most, she wants to move to Guatemala City from where she is. I want to Please ask you a question, in. Dave. Uh, well, I want to ask you some questions. You're obviously very familiar with Guatemala. It's one of the three countries, we're told, where people are escaping certain death. Are children facing certain death if they're returned to Guatemala? Are you there, Dave? Oh, don't tell me we lost them. Mark? Dave, Mark. can you hear me? Yeah, I lost you for a minute. All right, uh, can I ask you a question? Absolutely. When children go, would, would children be facing, quote-unquote, certain death upon their return to Guatemala? Not, not in the areas. We, we, we travel from Guatemala, Guatemala City to a town called San Lucas Tolma. It's about three hours west of Guatemala City. We haven't seen anything like that. Like, I, I heard that one congressman, and I felt your pain when you were... It's, it's ridiculous that an adult talks like that. We didn't see anything having to do with certain death. Like I said, man, these kids, these kids are joyful. They're happy. The people, these people are are destitute, but they're joyful. And nobody ever talks about leaving Guatemala. So they're not facing certain death necessarily. I mean, it, absolutely look, not. Look, every country has its dangerous areas where there's uh, uh, high crime and so forth. But the fact that you return to Guatemala doesn't mean you're facing certain death. So when Charlie Rangel says that this is like the St. Louis with the Jews and they're turned back and they have to go back to Germany and, and they're exterminated. Is that not it's, sick? It's absurd. We go there twice a year. It's, we're totally safe. Well, maybe there. Charlie Rangel should go to Guatemala. I mean, uh, rather than his, uh, his condo in the Dominican Republic, maybe he should check out Guatemala. What do you think? Well, tell him to come build houses with us. Yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> Unless you have interest-free loans, he's not interested. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my friend, that was very helpful for your information. I appreciate it.